I'm live. Am I live? Can we see? Oh, right, where do we need to see? Here we go. Right, hopefully. Hopefully this is going to work. Can everybody see so far? Oh, I've got two here. Oh my god, the internet won't stop going out on my actual laptop, everybody. Sorry about this. Hi there. How is everybody? Right, there we go. This should be working now. I've got one on everything and it keeps cutting out and then I've got this one that looks alright but obviously I'm trying to get it to tip down a little bit because it's a little bit high. So hopefully you can all see where the washing up bowl is. Way Here we go. I've got my new ring light. Let me shut this down a bit because this is a bit bright. I nearly couldn't fathom what I was doing then. Right, so hopefully, hopefully I've got it on both channels now. We're hoping. Hi everybody. So I'm trying to get it so it's just a little bit brighter there. That's it. Is that better? Yay! And I've still got you all and you can see what I'm actually going to be doing. Because today we are doing peanut butter. Are you ready for this? Peanut butter biscuits. Now, before you even ask, no. I have, um, I can't get the writing off now. I've got all these comments coming through and I can't actually get them to go off my screen because I have now can't see my screen. Do we like the new ring light, by the way? Oh, sorry, I'm trying to have one ring light. Um, it won't let me... What is going on with this? Hi, Dave. Hi, Sid. Hi, everybody watching in. For some reason, it won't let me... Hang on, let me... Oh, there we go. No. Okay, so we're just going to roll with this. Hi, Lee. How are you and the kids? Right, I'm hoping... There we go. I'm hoping... Oh, my God. It, what is it? It won't let me tap on the screen like normal. Let me do this and try and tap. Look, I'm trying to tap on both screens. Hi there, everyone. So this is probably the most random. This is because I've set the ring light up today. Look, it's just trying to prove errors for me. It won't. Oh, no, I'm, I'm leaving it. I don't care. It's on me. It's good. We've got light. And today on my Instagram one, we've got light. So we're all good. We're going there. We're going with this. We're rolling. We're rolling, people. So, first things first, we need to wash our hands. There we go. First things first. Right, wash your hands everybody, we're going to wash your hands. Today is peanut butter, peanut butter biscuits. Now, I've never made these before. This is a first for me, I'm excited. It's uh, going to be an experience, I think. And I'm looking forward to it. I've already done this once, but here we go. So, I'm looking forward to these peanut butter biscuits. It should be a simple, fun, easy snack for everyone to be able to do. Um, yeah, I've not had them before, so this should also be fun, 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 because I don't really know how to make them, but I'm sure we'll find it out, and uh, as we go along, I'm sure there'll be some bits where, if anyone ever needs to ask, ask any questions, feel free to just ask them, because I never quite know what I'm doing, so if there's anything you want to know about things, I'm trying to get this, this actually moves, oh, it actually moves. Oh, the whole thing moves. I've got a new ring light and I'm enjoying trying to work out how to use it, although I'm not totally sure what I'm doing with it most of the time. Hang on. Here we go. It lets me move it from before. Oh, right, okay, okay. Right, I've worked it out now, people. So now I can actually, oh, I get it. I get it. I've just bought a ring light. I'm not very good with said ring light. I don't really know what's going on with ring light most of the time, but yeah, here we go. That is better. Oh, okay, so how is the light for everyone if I put it there? Hopefully we've got light both sides now because everyone on my YouTube channel said that it was really dark. So, hi James, hi everybody watching in, listening in. So right, so you need 175 grams of sugar. That's a lot of sugar. And then you need any form of peanut butter. And you need one egg. So I'm gonna grab the egg out of the fridge. Grab the egg. Oh wow. I've got one egg. Oh. 
Tomorrow is mug cake. Mug, not mud. I'm excited for mug cake. A little bit nervous because I've never done mug cake before. We'll give it a whirl, we'll give it a whirl. So you need a bowl, you need an egg, you need your sugar and you need your peanut butter. Um, you're going to literally get a, and it's right behind this. You're gonna get a baking tray with a, a baking tray and some baking paper. I obsessively have baking paper everywhere. We're gonna get the baking tray out of the cupboard. So excuse the movement of the camera. Because you need to put your biscuits on the baking tray. I didn't think of this first, did I? So, baking tray, biscuits. Right. First thing first, put the baking sheet onto your tray. You're going to put your biscuits on there. You're going to put your oven on onto 180. So it's nice and warm. Oh, we've got a tray in there already as well. Let me tie my hair up because we don't want hair in our food. And I haven't got a hair tie, so we're going to have to turn it around there. Here we go. I'm hoping everyone's liking the dress today. I went a bit Spanish vibe. <laughs> Lee, why is your phone so bad? Mine's bad today. Right, so you put your sugar and your peanut butter in. The reason you can see some weird colouring in the sugar is because I've actually added a little bit of cinnamon. Know, I love cinnamon, so I've added a bit of cinnamon because I like. I think it might add something to it, but obviously I've never cooked this, so this could go really badly. I'm going to dim this down. Oh no, make it brighter, darker, darker, brighter. Because I've got a halo. Hello. From the light behind me. Is everyone enjoying the light so far? Oh my god. Okay, so peanut butter's not actually that easy to get out of the jar. Oh. I've actually got a combination because I've got two peanut butters in here. Because I had half a jar of one and half a jar of the other. So at the minute, I've got two kinds in here. I've got crunchy and I've got smooth. What's your favourite people, crunchy or smooth? I'm intrigued to know the answer to that. I'm a crunchy peanut butter lover. I love the crunchy bits. It's like I like the bits in orange juice as well. For me, that's a definite yay. Wow. This is definitely going to get messy, I feel. Once you've got all your peanut butter out, you should have 200 grams of peanut butter. Get it out of the jar. Wow. Maybe I could. Oh, I've got a buzzy fly running around now. Oh, look. Oh my god, this is what happens when you have the back door open. I've got the back door wide open because it's such a nice day. Maybe that was an error. It's going to drive me mad. Anyone that knows me knows that my big pet hate of mine is bugs, flies, anything like that. Not bad. Not a fan. I can't get it to get rid of this bright light halo behind me. Let me try shutting the hub window. Has that made it better or worse? Mm -hmm. I'm liking this ring light though. So, maybe it's just because I'm such a golden child today. Who am I kidding? Right, so simple snacks and basic bakes. There's been so many now and I've had so many great comments from you all. So if there's anything you want to see me cook or bake, just give me a shout and let me know. Get involved, people. I want to see everyone's bakes. I want to see what you manage to get up to. So tomorrow we're doing mug cake. I'll put the recipe up as soon as we're finished. And uh, you can uh, give that a whirl. Right, so you're going to mix this sugar and peanut butter together. It's going to become a mess, I reckon. There we go, there we go. So make sure this all goes together as smoothly as you can get it. Wow, this is sticky. Here we go. So, we've got mix now oh, everywhere. We've got peanut butter and sugar. So this is the first stage. So what you're going to do next, once you've got all this peanut butter and sugar mixed together, you are then going to crack in 
a scrambled egg. So basically, I'm going to get a cup. We're going to put the egg on, oh, not to break it. Right, so you've got your egg, there's no, sh no shell in there, thank God. So, egg, you're going to whisk your egg. See, I always like to keep a bowl of water next to me because I seem to have this tendency to need to wash my hands quite a lot. So, mix your egg. Oh, I've gone really dark there. Ooh. Mix your egg. And slowly, you're going to add your egg into this. So, Put a tiny bit in at first because you don't want it too too much and you're going to make it so that it's like a dough so this is going to help your peanut butter biscuits to stick together and be the best that they can be so make sure you mix it all really really well until it's like a dough i'm wearing it doesn't look like a dough <laughs> it doesn't look like a dough it looks like a mess I don't really know how these are going to turn out today, people. As I said, never done them before. Right, add the last bit of egg in. Oh, because there was so much in there. So your oven should be really warm by now. So you're literally going to do these as quick as you can. You're going to mix it all together. There we go. It is kind of like a dough. It does say roll them into balls. I'm not sure I can roll this into a ball. Not even sure how these are going to turn out. Anyway, so I'm just going to dollop some bits of it onto the paper and then we're going to flatten them with a fork. Oh wow. Here we go. We're going to flatten them with a the fork. Make them into little round ball balls. Flatten them in the, with the fork. And then we're going to put them in the oven for 15 minutes. If anyone's still got me, we have got peanut butter. Peanut butter biscuits. They look like a lot of a mess at the minute, but if you love your peanut butter, hopefully you'll love these. So, we're going to put a load on the tray. There we go. I feel like these are going to be really big biscuits. I'm not quite prepared, I don't think. And I didn't make any earlier, so I can't even do the here's the ones I did earlier. Because normally I've got some that I've just been baking. As you all know, I've been trying to get it so that you actually get to see a finished product. But we're going to have to hope that these come out okay. I've followed the recipe. Hi, Anthony. Right, so it says to... They look a bit smushy, but never mind. We're, we're going with it. See, this is what happens when you bake like. You never quite know what's going to happen. We've got our biscuits. They do look a bit rough around the edges, but they're nearly all surrounded on the tray. Okay, so I see what it means. Right, okay. Hang on. Let me see if I can pick it up. Oh, you can pick it up. Oh, you can make it into... Okay. Pick it up and roll it into that. Put it into a little biscuit. There we go. Maybe I should have rolled these in the first place. Apparently, you don't need flour, no. You just need peanut butter, egg, and sugar. Apparently. This is what it says. I think this is a myth one, but we've rolled with it. This is what it says. 200 grams of peanut butter. It says 200 grams of peanut butter, one egg, and 175 grams of sugar. So we should see. Goes man, I'm thinking it needs flour too, but allegedly it doesn't. So right now we've got these on the tray. They actually do look more like biscuits when you roll them. They are very sticky. So just be wary. They are sticky as hell. But hey, who doesn't love a bit of mess? So I've flattened some on the tray. They are very, very odd looking. I so want to lick my hands because it's all peanut butter. I'm going to get that off my hands a bit more. As I said, this is why we have the bowl. With the water. So you can just get it off your hands. Perfect. Right, so. Here's my little attempt at these biscuits. 
apparently push them down with a fork. They don't look very good when I do, but I'm still gonna. So they're all on the tray. Oh, let's put them in. 10 minutes. It says 10 minutes. Let's hope these work. Anyway, people, so <laughs> tomorrow we've got mug cake. You're gonna need a microwavable mug. You're gonna need your microwave and you're gonna need there's so many ingredients for this one. I tried to find a simplest recipe, but we didn't end up doing it. So we've got lots of ingredients in that and I will post them straight after this on my Instagram so you can all find them and so you can all get involved tomorrow. Hopefully you've been enjoying all these simple snacks and basic bakes. I try and make them the simplest, easiest things that I can find, a bit like these peanut ones. Um, I don't know how these are gonna turn out. Really don't. Um, I hope everyone's been enjoying it though, it's all been good fun. Um, I want to see all of your pictures because I know that everyone's been trying to do some of these. So we did the bark the other day, I love doing the chocolate bark, probably my favourite one so far. And then we did, what else have we done so far, cruffins, egg muffins, we've got the dog coming in right now, <laughs> love these. We do Macy Moo? So if I want to see the little dog. What are you doing? She's licking my feet. Messy. This is our little monster we've got. You can have a shot. Oh look, this is little Macy. Mm -hmm. Look, say hello, Macy. Say hello. Go on then, your little monster. Running around in the kitchen. But obviously, we've got to wash our hands. So we're doing this little bacon thing. Why was I doing the bacon thing? Because I wanted my niece and nephew to do something with me. Even though some days they can, some days they can't. I also wanted something fun to do every day so that people can join along, get involved, and, because obviously I can't DJ at the minute, until I can DJ. But I've now got the equipment, so hopefully, hopefully, we'll be able to DJ soon. Anyway, right, I'm gonna love you all and leave you all because I'm gonna hopefully, Oh, they're spreading quite a lot. They actually do look quite nice. They smell very nice. Anyway, I'm going to post a picture after on my Instagram because they're going to take ages to cook, I think. Well, not ages. It's 12 minutes, but still. Um, don't forget you can catch me tomorrow at 12 o'clock doing the mug cake. It's in the microwave. It's three minutes. All the ingredients will be live on my YouTube, Instagram, everywhere. So you can catch up with me. If you miss any of the episodes as um, simple snacks and basic bakes you can catch up with them on the youtube channel so just go on my youtube channel there's a whole folder all the simple snacks and basic bakes are on there everything from sausage rolls crumpet pizza microwave crisps yesterday literally there's a million things there um i've just had someone saying it's cutting out really bad on the youtube and everything really sorry about that i think it's because there's so many people on the internet and mine so there's not much i can do about that but my YouTube will get reposted from the Instagram, which is a lot of a better, a, it's a better feel, a better quality of recording, if that makes sense. So if anyone wants to rewatch any, just catch up on there. Um, these biscuits are spreading like wildfire. They're a lot bigger than I thought they'd be. So this is so far. They've obviously got another five to ten minutes, so you'll. I'll post pictures and let you know how they get on, but hopefully you've enjoyed it. Hopefully you'll all join me for a live mix at some point when I go live DJ, and I'll let you all know when it is. And don't forget, if you want to see any of the videos again, you can catch up on the YouTube channel. So just literally YouTube DJ Sarah Giggle or Sarah Giggle, and it will come up with my page. And then you can find all of the little things that we've been cooking and baking. Hi Richard, hi everyone, hi Kinky Malinky. How are you guys all doing? How is everybody doing as well? As in, I want to know. So if you've been enjoying all these, just let me know. If there's anything you want me to bake, let me know. As long as it's simple, quick, fun, easy, and the stuff isn't hard to get, we'll go with it. Anyway, people, I'm going to finish that there, but hopefully you've all enjoyed it.